In today's world, it's not sufficient to design autonomous systems that are able to repeat the given tasks in a repetitive manner. We must be ready to push the boundaries by leveraging the current state-of-the-art autonomy level towards smarter systems which will learn and interact with their environment, collaborate with people and other systems, plan their future actions and execute the given task accurately. Deep Tech Hub has a fascinating motion capture system with 15 by 15 by 5 meters of flight arena equipped with 12 Wicon V8 tracking cameras capable of tracking multiple flying objects in 6 degree of freedom with a range of millimeters of accuracy. My research is about graph structure data analysis for computer vision applications like human action recognition. Uh, we do research on skeleton-based human action recognition by modeling a sequence of body poses in an action video as an evolving graph. Proposing such uh, efficient perception methods like efficient human action recognition is of great importance in uh, robotics for human uh, behavior characterization, human computer interaction, and many other uh, real real time applications with uh, limited computational resources like uh, embedded GPUs and uh, just CPUs. In our research, we make digital twins of robotic systems. In our research, we have developed uh, Aarhus University Robotics Toolbox. And this toolbox allows uh, users with little to no experience with robots and digital twins to achieve very high fidelity mathematical models of robots. What we hope to be able to achieve with this research is very high fidelity digital twins of robotic systems. So we can do, for instance, payload estimation, safety monitoring and predictive maintenance. One of our research areas here at Alab is safe vessel navigation through congested harbor and waterways. We're utilizing autonomous drones and state-of-the-art AI to tell the captain the distance between his vessel and all the surrounding solid objects. This will enable the captain to have a safely trip from A to his destination. So the prospects of this research is that maybe in the future we can use this technology to enable uh, autonomous ship floating around in harbors and having no captains at all. In AirLab, we designed the autonomous surveillance systems for the monitoring of traffic patterns we try to meet artificial intelligence with drones to learn anomalies in an autonomous way and to notify human operators in case of any abnormalities. Our ultimate goal is to learn anomalies in a fully autonomous way and to eliminate any mistakes caused of human factors and to improve the safety of society. The research here is mainly about the application of mobile manipulator in a factory and it's mainly about the force control and the computer vision part. For now, we apply the AI, enable the robot to detect the feature of the humans of the working stations to keep the safety. In the future, I think the mobile robot can work as a co-worker in a factory so they can improve the working efficiency of the whole factory.